and we're back for episode 2 of Fallout New Vegas. So let's continue where we left off. Therapy, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. See, unlike Fallout 3, you don't have to do anything extra to choose. Right, I'm definitely going to go for repair, because that'll give me enough to get the gun. Lockpick, definitely. And because you wouldn't think about it but um, speech can get you out of quite a lot of predicaments quite easily before I turn you loose I need one more thing from you you got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history just a formality ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head uh, right, this I always choose Wild Wastelander. What that does is things in the game that are, hit you, probably, that are hidden unless you have this perk. Like the Alien Blast, you cannot acquire it without this perk. The Fedora, the uh, the reference to Indiana Jones, you cannot get it without this perk. So it's always a good thing to have. But I can't remember what I normally choose here, so I'm just going to quickly read through it. In your heart moment. Yes. Energy, energy weapons. Explosive guns. Yeah, that's fine. Choose the FEQ2. Okay. Alright, I guess that about does it. And with me, I'll see you out. Pretty much, this is where I go on a rank, uh, looting spree and just loot all the loose items in the house like that have value like of course I already took the stim packs from on here uh, laser pistol and some ammo for it um, I believe there's a doctor's, yep, there's a doctor's bag right there um, I'll take the glasses just because. Um, right. Now, if you didn't know, Sunset, Sunset Sarsaparillos play a very big part in this game for many reasons, and it's nice to have as many as possible. So that's also something new I never realised was there. And all these bottle caps as well. See, I'm finding new stuff already. Um, I don't know why I opened that. There's a knife on there. An ammo box with quite a few ammo. Took all that. Took all of that. Oops, my bad. Yeah, it, not many people do this, but I mean, it, it gives you a little of a bit, a little bit of a head start when starting the game. So, um, yeah, well that's it. It's time for us to go out into the open world. Here, these are yours. It was all you had on you when you was brought in. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find an extra pin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a pip boy. I grew up in one of them vaults in made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much used to be now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on too so the locals don't pick on you for lacking modesty. Never was much my style anyway. Um, I don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. I'm gonna play a nice you talk guy. To mouth before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. 
Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. I'm not going to do that. I may go for again, eventually, after finishing it the first time, if I get, like, a lot of views on it, I'll go for it again on hardcore mode if people want me to. If not, then I won't. Uh, welcome to the world of Fallout New Vegas. And it's just telling you me about the thing. So like that. Oh, wrong one. Oh, wrong one. Okay. There we go, there's what my guy looks like at the moment. And this is Victor. He's the guy he has to go talk to. Why am I continuously walking? Hmm. Weird. Howdy, partner! Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Um. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Um... Can't say that I'm familiar with you rascals. Some of the fine folks in town not be able to help you out with that. So this is just like... Happy. Uh, just information of what happened to your to your character in the situation with that guy who shot you and stuff like that. Um, yeah. No, I'm gonna do the uh, tutorial, tutor, tutorials or whatever they are with this person. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry, she won't bite unless I tell her to. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. And the thing I like about this game the most, it you can become addicted to things if you drink too much, like Nuka Cola or something. I believe you can become addicted to it. Just get some bottle caps here. I keep. Uh, I'm gonna keep doing that for now. I keep forgetting. Um. I got to go meet her out the back. Oh, just readjusting myself. This is the gun I fixed in the doctor's house. It's quite useful. Yeah. Did the staff throw bottles in the fence? No, it's basically just target Take practice. Take this and try to hit a couple of them. My aim is quite terrible. I don't normally play this game on PC. Okay, I'm just going to crouch. There That's the right idea. Look down the site. See, she expects you to get the first one. Oh, actually aiming on the site. Oh, I don't know how I'm not getting these, to be honest. Start crouching down and staying still. It'll help you aim. Nice shot. So it's, it's well, that's how a start, I'm gonna shoot. But I don't reckon you came now. to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from my water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Now you always do this. It's help. free XP. <laughs> stuff like that, so it's quite useful to be doing. Yeah, I I played Fallout 3 on the PC, but ever since then I before I I got this game when I got my new PC, so 
like my mouth, I don't have a mouse mat at the moment, so my mouth is a bit stiff every now and then. Um, actually I believe... No, it's not. I think over there somewhere, over in that direction, is the, uh, there's a fridge with a skeleton in it, and it has a fedora. Uh, it's the reference to Indiana Jones. I believe it's the third film where he hides in the uh, fridge in the nuclear in the nuclear testing site. I believe. I think it's the third one anyway. Maybe the second or whatever. Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. See, this is uh, teaching you about basically sneak attack point uh, hits. If you sneak up on an enemy and you're hidden, obviously it's not going to work for me because my uh, sneak skill is quite bad. You get a high, you, you can get a high chance of getting critical hit, and your critical hits will be stronger. Come on. You've still got. Some. Thanks. Sunny, whatever the hell your name is, out there. I'm going to show off fat mode. See? You're getting the hang of it. There's two more wells that still need clearing. You want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. Uh, Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially with two of us. Well, I only have two me. minutes left on me. Uh, I'm unfortunately restricted of how long I can post, so it's 15 minutes. And I record at 14 minutes because, well, better to be safe than sorry. So I've got another two minutes left, so. I'll try to get as much done with this as possible. Um, but the first and second episode are being recorded together. Uh, the third episode will be recorded probably in a few days, third and fourth, maybe even fifth, and mm. <sighs> very tired. I hope you're all enjoying this. I know I, I would enjoy watching a Let's Play on this game. I absolutely love it. I would probably say it's one of my favourite RPGs in ever that I've ever played. Like this is Vats mode. It's kind of I don't know how to explain it, but you'll see. Choose areas of an enemy you want to shoot at, and it does this. Alright, for some weird reason these geckos are not moving, which makes my life easier. Right. Holy moly! We talked to her. I got first. You didn't come here like you've done. I'd be a goner for sure. I came up here to draw water, but here, you should have what I got. You look thirsty. No, it's just saying that because I've been helpful and saved her. People in Good Springs now like me more. And that concludes episode two. Please like, favorite, and subscribe, and have a nice day.